Hello guys and welcome back to Franbo. My name is Tripender and last time we got out of the mental hospital and through the maze and into the forest and met some ant guy and let's see what he has to say. There you are. Oh wow! You're you're really a very big ant. Who's there? Uh oh, excuse me, sir. Are you real? Ah, you always ask the same thing. Always. Always? What do you mean by always? Of course I'm real. Where did you come from? Oh, I escaped the mental hospital. But please don't tell anybody. I won't tell anybody. Don't worry. But what are you doing here? Real bad things happened to me, sir, but now I'm looking for my cat. A cat, you say? Yes, sir, a black cat with, ve with very big yellow eyes. Mr. Midnight. Oh, I see. I'm sorry, girl. Oh, so you haven't seen it? It happens to be that the cat is eaten, chewed and swallowed. Eaten? What do you mean? The black cat came towards me in a hurry. I catch it. I give it to my beetle pig. My beetle pig is hungry. Oh, my poor beetle pig hasn't had food in days. The blueberry time passed by and we ate them all. Stop it. Can't you see? Mr. Midnight is the only one I have. Please tell me that you're joking. Oh, little girl. Don't cry, I can sing a song for you if you like. What will I do now? You don't know how it feels to be alone. I do know, yes. I'm the last one alive. Let me help you, yes? How could you possibly help me? The digestion is not so fast, you know. Maybe he's still alive inside a bit big. Should I do something, like make the beetle pig vomit? Kill the beetle pig! He is also the only friend I have left, but I need the meat. Kill your beetle pig friend? I... I can do it. Yes. Do it. You can kill the beetle pig. And I, Antonio the Greatest, shall eat the meat. Okay. So, kill the beetle pig. Sounds good. Let's just do it. Oh, good. <laughs> okay, let's see what's here. Okay, oh well. Oh well, I could try opening it and see what's inside. Let's do that. Huh. What a bluff. There's no hole in here. Ah, what a piece of shit. Okay, let's kill this beetle pig. Fuck you, beetle pig. No. God damn it. Come here, you shit. Wake up, the pig won't stay still. It seems that shouting and pushing him won't help. Okay. Oh. Oh, please, God, tell me you're not gonna tickle the big ant. Oh, tickle, tickle, okay. God damn it. Tickle him. Tickle, tickle. Ah, the threat is great. Great! Sir, wake up now. I think the beetle pig doesn't like the idea of being killed. Oh, I see. But that's completely normal, isn't it? Yes, but what should I do then? You have to give him the special berries. 
The blueberries. Mmm. But there are no bears in the woods. I shouldn't say this to you, but I have the right connections. They live inside my house. They have blueberries. My house is in that direction. Be careful. Oh, thank you, sir. Okay, let's go to his house then. Is there something here? Oh. Oh. No! God damn it. Why did you fall in there? Huh? Can I pick him up? Mm, beep beep. Look, friend. I'm in danger. I guess I can't pick him up. Okay. Huh. Oh, a big uh, anthill. Okay. Let's get in there. This must be the ant's house. It seems to be open but very stuck. Okay then. Fuck this door. Oh no, I broke the door. Well, now I can get in. Yes, you can. Mm. I don't see any blueberries. I wish I could sleep with my kitty on this bed. Oh god, I think I could. Oh god, Ugh. the queen of meat. Yeah, gross. <laughs> oh god damn it. Ooh, glue. I shouldn't take out this stuff, but I want to super glue something I couldn't read. I forgot. You wouldn't mind if I take a little meat for those hunger. Nope. You better not. What's in here? Oh! Oh! Blueberries! Uh, the blueberries! Ow! That hurts! Uh, fuck you, pinecone! Hmm. Can I slap them with the steak? Well... Can I glue them in place? Maybe? Oh, sorry. I pushed. No. God damn it. What do I do then? Hmm, maybe if I do. Uh. Uh. This? No? Ah, the. And obvious, I guess. Fuck you, baby pinecone. <sighs> Can I chop them to bits, maybe? I won't even try that. Oh, okay. Why not? God damn it. What do I do? Maybe if I take a pill. Oh! Hello! Oh, now I get it. Lure the ants away, maybe. Yes. Get in here. It worked! Now the bag's mine! Yes, and what's inside? Oh, rat trap and some sort of card. Exterminator. Okay. There's nothing else in here I can take. No. Okay. Well then, now I know what to do at least. There you go. Now fuck you. And... Take the berries. Yes, they smell delicious. Okay, good to know. Now let's get back and kill that fucking pig. Oh, hello. Wait, I haven't taken the pills, right? Nope. 
no? So this this thing here is real. Okay, goodbye. Fuck you. I didn't want to talk to you anyways. Now then, Beetle Pig, you must die. There we go. Oh, fuck, it's... It's a rat? Okay, that's not a cat, but... What? You're not my cat? Oh, miss, you saved me from misery. Good for you, but I was hoping to find somebody else. I assume that you're feeling disappointed. Who are you looking for? My cat. My lovely cat, Mr. Midnight. Oh, Miss Lady, I'm not very fond of cats, you know. A black one with big yellow eyes was trying to catch me. Really? You seem to get in trouble often. Wait, maybe it's my cat. Oh, my lady, if he is, then he's the one in trouble now. Why? What happened? I can show you. Follow me, please. It's not far from here. Okay then, show the way, Mr. Rat. Oh, can I take the axe back? No. Okay. Here we are. Somebody took him, miss. They just disappeared. Oh my goodness. Could you be more specific? I wish I could. It looked like the earth swallowed them. If there's anything else I can do for you, just let me know. I'll be around. Yes, I heard that you took a fucking comb also. Yes. <laughs> oh, the hair comb. The shiny, beautiful hair comb. Can I have it, please? Alright then, but can you please comb my hair first? Yes, I can comb your hair. Oh. How nice. Not. Thank you, my lady. You are very kind. Okay, let's go brush those faces stuck to the tree. That sounded very weird. But let's talk to this guy first. The beetle pig is dead now, sir. Thank you. Now we eat. I can't, just so you know. Inside the beetle pig there was no cat, but a rat. A rat? Oh, I'm so sorry. You see, my eyes are very old. I also have heart problems and a very bad back. I also suffer from narcolepsy and sometimes I don't... Okay. He has a lot of health problems, that guy. Okay, let's comb these fucks here. Here is your beautiful comb, misters. Oh, how lovely. Oh, you, friend a person. You finally did it. Hope the key opens the door. Here we should open. Now we fly south at last. Goodbye. Okay. Goodbye to you too. Oh, beautiful. Shiny mistress. Have a nice trip. I got the key. Yay. Now then. Oh! Okay, okay, yeah, right. Maybe it opens something over there. At uh, the Antonio's house. Oh! I didn't see that before. Must have missed it. Oh! A door handle! To handle big problems. I'll keep it. Uh, oh! 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 I, I can I get it now? I think I do. Combine, yeah, and combine, yay! And I'm guessing since I have kind of gotten the hang of the logic in this game that I can use it on the well, probably. Oh crap, the red stuff. Okay, well, I don't really care. 
let's see if this works. This is really odd. My own door is locked. Err. Let's take this key. And yay! It worked! Woohoo! Let's go in there. What a curious little door. I wonder where it would lead me. Mr. Midnight, are you here? Oh, hello, behind me. Oh, uh, crap. Chapter 2, Part 2, Double Personality. Well, let's uh, end it here for this one, and we'll continue tomorrow. Uh, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.